Hey, what's going on? You know who it is. You know what it is. All right, you guys, I'm going to be the first one to put the actual video out about this. Uh, Snoop Dogg got the Internet going crazy. I mean, Snoop Dogg basically stole the show at the Mike Tyson, Roy Jones uh, exhibition fight. Uh, Snoop Dogg's commentary was a one. Get a man a job. I mean, Snoop Dogg got everybody from Stephen A. Smith to just everybody praising him on his commentary. You know, I don't think much of Stephen A. Smith, but at the end of the day, he is a journalist. This is what he does for a living. And um, Snoop Dogg did his thing, not to mention he, you know, five one up, you know. Um, I expect the, the the job offers to come flying in. Snoop Dogg is probably going to have a future uh, in sports doing commentary. And one of my subs reminded me when I was doing, you know, the live stream that Snoop does have a background in sports. And I keep forgetting Snoop plays basketball. He coaches football. Uh, he has somewhat of a boxing background because he knows a lot of boxers. So at the end of the day, I got to just say the commentary was was very good you know uh izzy the mma fighter uh sugar ray leonard and you know you know the cat from showtime the commentary was just on point it was entertaining you know i just think as far as this go they have something and it proved that four people can do commentary they didn't talk over each other you know you had sugar ray leonard the former you know, the former, you know, legendary boxer, Hall of Famer, you know, uh, being the serious guy, breaking down the fight. But, you know, Sugar Ray Leonard been doing commentary for, you know, 30 years, you know. So this is not new to him. Then you had the dude from Showtime who added the, you know, the flavor, you know, being, the you, you know, hyperactive, you know, Caucasian dude. But he's good at what he does. He brings a lot of energy because basically... You know, when you listen to guys like Al Bernstein, Al Bernstein is 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 good at what he does, but he kind of isn't, you know, what you would call hip enough. Then you had the the MMA fighter Izzy. He was he was good too. He let loose a little bit too. Um, everybody knew what they was doing, and and like I said, Snoop stole the show. I ain't gonna even lie that commentary where he said this looked like two of my uncles fighting at a barbecue. That was funny. I, I broke out laughing. I can't lie, but everybody is praising Snoop Dogg and people are saying Snoop Dogg need a job. I, hey, it's like this. You know, I've had a love hate relationship, a up and down relationship with Snoop Dogg, but I'm not going to deny that the man is good at what he does. I'm not even going to lie because Snoop Dogg did piss me off plenty of times for real. But as far as what he does pertaining to entertainment, he is one of the best all around entertainers out there. You know, I'm just keeping it. I'm just keeping it 100. I wasn't feeling that interview he did with The Undertaker because <laughs> The Undertaker is full of shit. The Undertaker, old school racist. But, you know, that might not, you know, Snoop Dogg may not know it. So I'm going to be fair to him. But if you don't understand the history with, the WWE and their historic uh, racial innuendos towards any non, you know, white wrestler. I don't know what to tell you, but yeah, Snoop, he, he stole the show. Get a man a job. Like I said, uh, I told some of my subs to send, you know, some highlights to Steven Espinosa, but I'm telling you right now, if Snoop can keep his F-bombs down, <laughs> even though you should be able to talk like Snoop Dogg because you are on premium cable. So I don't know why it's such a big deal, but I know they try to say kids be watching. For the most part, no seven, eight-year-olds be watching no damn boxing. So just stop it. But uh, nevertheless, though, Snoop Dogg did his thing. So, you know, get a man a job. He was the, he was one of the best things about the event. You know, he sold the event, you know what I'm saying? Based off his commentary, he made it better than what it really was. So, you know, it is what it is. This your boy town biz.
I'm out.